Hey everybody, welcome back to Big Red EDC. Well, as you can see there on the table, today is something just a little bit different. It's not quite an EDC knife, but it's a knife that a lot of people have actually requested to see in a video and during the live streams. So I just wanted to take a little bit here and kind of show it off. This is obviously the United States Navy desk knife that you guys see in my reviews. You kind of see the edge of it, maybe not all of it. You can see it sometimes in the live stream, depending on how the, I have the camera angle set up. But as I said, it's United States Navy desk knife. My youngest son got this for me for this past Christmas. He knew I wanted, I asked, of course, I asked for knives for Christmas. There was a long list, but he wanted to find something a little bit different and something with a little bit of meaning behind it. As several of you know, I am a retired Navy. I'm a Navy vet. Now, he was a little bit bummed. He's like, Dad, I really tried to find one with a submarine on it, but I just couldn't find one. And I was like, that's fine, buddy. This thing is awesome. But as you can see there, get a little closer. Let me close this massive beast up. So one, I don't hurt myself. And as you can see there, it's got the aircraft carrier. It says Navy. Kind of a embossed type flag, I guess. That's what you would call it. But, I mean, definitely not going to be edc with this thing. And that's what it gets a lot of comments like, man, you should EDC that thing. No, probably not. But as you can see there, it is a lockback. Um, yeah, made in China, of course. I really have no idea what steel this is. Probably, I'm guessing, probably a 440A. That, that would be my guess. But it came with this nice, pretty awesome stand that came with it. But let's see. Just for the heck of it, we'll do a little bit of spec check on it. Overall length, can you guys see that? Hey, I'll move it up a little bit. Come on, we might as well, right? We're going to do this. Let's do it. So we're looking at about 17 and a quarter inches fully open. Uh, the handle gives us about 9 inches. And for a blade length, we're looking at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, just shy. Just shy of eight inches, seven and three quarter. So, oh, where's our cutting edge? And our cutting edge looks like one, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, yeah, just over six. Not quite six and a quarter. So, yeah, don't think I'll be EDC in this guy anytime soon. Oh, well, let's bust our, let's bust the scale out. And we'll give it a weight check. What do you think? What are you guys guessing? I think something like that. I know it's hard to tell. It's got some weight to it. I'm gonna, I have not weighed this. Uh, we're gonna start in ounces. I'm a fisherman. I like to guess fish weight. Oh man. Mmm. I'm gonna say 1.1. 1.1 pound. Ready? Oh, way off. <laughs> way off. <laughs> 1. 1.7. 1 pound, 7.5 ounces. Well, well, you know what that means. If I guess my fish weight's lower, then they're actually heavier than what I think they are. So that's cool. Fishermen never lie. We stretch the heck out of the truth. We never lie. There you go, guys. As I said... I've had quite a bit of requests to see this thing and I mean it's a it's pretty much a portion of it as at least in all the videos and the live stream but I just thought I would share that with everybody it's an awesome awesome gift uh, I will treasure it always and I, I just can't thank my son enough for it so as always guys it's been a pleasure 
talking to you guys today. Thanks for sharing a little time. Just checking out something that's a little bit out of the norm from my EDC videos. Greatly appreciate it. As always, guys, like, subscribe, leave me a comment. I love talking to y'all. Until next time, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.